will be none. All those advanced techniques I will explain to you during my um, X-ray SDK 0.7 Foundation by Alexander Moreau's video courses. So go ahead and get them and watch them all. Okay, so we're going to use this texture which is under Decal uh, Folder and Decal Floor 2. Go ahead and select that. Click OK. And um, the next thing what we're going to do, uh, we're going to close our Object Inspector and we're going to go to the Add button right here. We're going to click on it and now in the center of our mouse arrow we'll place the um, wall mark into our 3D model or 3D object and basically what we're going to do just click our with our left mouse button once and we will place it so we have our texture right here we can also place the multiple multiple the same ones or multiple different ones let me go ahead and pu put the multiple the same ones first okay and now you're going to go ahead and decide you want to delete them and how to delete them basically you're going to use the select arrow right here make sure your option is uh, edit mode in wall marks is selected then select the wall marks that you want to delete click delete button and it will delete it like so okay you can bring the multiple wall marks with the different textures on it let's go ahead and do so go ahead pre press enter two times now texture click on it on the triple uh, um, points left mouse of your button and let's go ahead and select the different uh, let's say like a lion cartoony style over here let's select the door actually and um, let me see yeah let's select the door something like so okay then click OK then close the object inspector click on add button right here now you can click and add some dirt click add button again and again click add, add again and add some dirt to our box okay you'll tell me well it's nice but they're all the same size kind of not cool alright let me show you how to scale them let's click delete button and delete some and click on select arrow here and select that we don't need delete this one and delete this one and make another dirt which is bigger how to do so click enter button to our object inspector object ex inspector in Walmart is responsible for resizing uh, selecting the texture, different texture for the wall marks, rotating, and etc. Always make sure the draw wall marks are check marked. Okay, let's go ahead and click on three width and uh, three height. Gonna click close and then use the add button icon and click somewhere. All right, we just the do it. Okay and it's better now okay let's go ahead and bring one more at the bottom but scale it as two and one or three and width and one and height so we're going to scale our texture so you're gonna see what it's going to look like also we're going to rotate it by let's say by three or even not three but like so so it's not going to look just the same I'm gonna close it I'm gonna click add button to add our wall mark and click where we would like to add it let's say over here in the corner like so you can see it stretched the texture because with the 3 and height is not 3 so it's not squared it's stretched it's 1 
so you learn how to manipulate with the Vomax okay and uh, you learn how to delete them and uh, you learn how to bring them to a model how to select the model and basically during this video tutorial you also learn how to delete the wall marks how to manipulate with wall marks how to bring the multiple wall marks basically you learn how to work with the wall marks or textures that are part of the library of the stalker call of prepaid game original game as well as the same as level editor so it's as a core of the library of those wall marks okay during the next video tutorial you will learn how to bring your custom wall marks that you're going to design in photoshop or you're going to design in uh, gimp to bring into the stalker call of prepaid through the level editor through the x-ray sdk and how to do so i will teach you in the next video tutorial which will be advanced wall marks video okay so it's going to be part of the uh, uh, x-ray sdk 0.7 uh, foundation by alex morose and it's going to be the next video by the way now if you will go ahead and file and save the level and then you need to go ahead and compile the level you need to go through the multiple stages to um, import this level to the all the requirements the stalker color of prepaid needs it's not going to work if you're just going to save it and just bring it to the folder of the call of prepaid uh, stalker call of prepaid game you need to go through the compile and you need to go through the different uh, methods and uh, basically steps to bring it in, into the stalker call of prepaid how to do so uh, as again is going to be part of the another video tutorial step by step into my uh, extra SDK foundation um, video tutorial series so don't miss it I'm going to be finishing on that and let me go ahead and jump into the stalker so I'm going to show you how it's look like of what we just did and I will see you in the next video tutorial if I'm not going to post um, advanced, probably not advanced vault marks on YouTube. It's it, for sure will be in my uh, extra SDK foundation by Alexander Morose. Don't miss it. Watch it all. As again, I promise to you by purchasing my extra SDK foundation by Alexander Morose that I dedicated a couple months to it and. Um, spend a lot of money on it a time and effort I will teach you how to create the mode to stalker call of prepaid uh, x-ray engine step by step and um, it will be designed for the total beginner if you will watch it from the start to finish you will be able to create it okay and I will have full support for it as well so let's go ahead and um, I will finish on that video and let's go ahead and uh, I will go ahead compile this level go through the, all the steps and bring this level into the stalker call of prepaid and we will see how this level look like uh, in stalker call of prepaid and what we just did okay it will take some minutes and I will see you there All right, we're uh, as you can see, we're loading the stalker from the uh, particular uh, shortcut and uh, just loading straight our level. And you can do so by skipping introduction and etc. Over here, you can see it's uh, blinking and it's a black box and they're behind. Uh, we will learn how to get rid of that black box and put our uh, image for our level 
or our location and uh, it's not that simple as you can think it is because it's, you gotta you gotta say to x-ray engine okay here is how many images I wanted and they going to rotating uh, during every different start of the uh, that level uh, different image will show and it's not like you gotta just replace the image it's like you need to tell what image needs to be there and uh, why okay and also I will show you and teach you how to do so in the, my video series okay let's go ahead and run and see what we have alright this is our level as you can see it's not we don't have the um, landscape yet it's just black because I compiled my map or my level uh, to uh, lowest settings uh, as you don't know uh, you need to compile and go through all those steps to be able to import the level or location into the stalker call of prepaid game and you can do it at the low settings at the high settings or custom settings right now it's set to low it takes just a few uh, like a minute or so to do so on i7 and but it depends to the level how big the level this level is so small as you can see that's why um yeah so basically the graphics is not going to be so fantastic but i can compile definitely high and advanced with level compiling and all of this stuff you will learn in my x-ray sdk foundation by alexander moroz video series tutorials don't miss it i'll explain every single piece for you so you will be uh get expert uh, in the uh, x-ray uh molding trust me guys if you will uh watch my video series complete uh, from start to beginning so it'll be like about five or seven plus hours and uh, i'm not going to post all of them on youtube but don't miss it make sure to get it it's 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 totally worth it especially for those guys uh, it's totally worth it especially for those guys who is um, was waiting for the stalker 2 now you have a chance to um, build a stalker 2 by yourself and uh, push beyond the limit of the x-ray engine trust me it can go far beyond of that when the people uh, developers created the x-ray stalker call of uh, prepaid game on x-ray engine 1.6 plus uh, they uh, didn't push beyond the limit of its capability uh, now the hardware getting better and faster you can push it beyond the limit and even get much better game bring more atmosphere better graphics and more uh, details to the levels but we will talk about it in my uh, x-ray SDK uh, foundation by Alexander Moroz video series don't miss it let's go ahead and check it out Let's check how our box look like and I know exactly where our box located in this level. Here's our box as you can see Yars 2 the third uh, decal be integrated then it's going to be the uh, enlarged one uh, with the small one right here and then the squeezed one and as you can see when the squeezed one looking so nice so natural so stalker um, basically x-ray engine just uh, even uh, when enlarging the textures uh, the wall marks and squeezing them make them look almost natural as it is so you can see sharp very nice and that's how we did it okay so that's how you can bring some details to your uh, texturing add some details in the level editor in x-ray sdk as well as bring some signs some symbols etc so basically bring some details into your scene into your level and not using the 3ds max studio or some other 3d editors but uh, the free level editor that included in the x-ray sdk all right thank you so much for watching as again my name is alexander moroz and the x-ray sdk foundation by alex moroz is coming don't miss it out and uh, yeah they're coming they will teach you a lot uh, the, basically they will teach you from start to finish how to create your own mode in, for stalker call of prepaid and uh, basically it will give you the skills how to basically recreate the whole stalker game the way you want to see it
okay thank you so much for watching please subscribe and so you're not going to miss any other videos and please thumbs up so more people can see it thank you so much my name is alexander moroz and i will see you till the next video tutorial bye bye now